Fail big. Yep, that's it. That's all you're getting. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Sasquatch. Typical failure. Uh, I don't have the cards, so the questions will have much less... Impact? Accuracy. Yeah, because they were so insightful before. <laughs> yes. Um, Ladouche, who had many questions, and I've been... Mm -hmm. you know, Slowly doling Parsing them. Yep. Uh, as we need, since most of you do not give us questions. And, yeah. We like that. more. Thanks That's a lot for failure. that. Thanks a lot. But uh, Ladouche had a pretty good question, I think. Oh, God. And this is... If you were to add a color to magic, what would it be, mm -hmm. and what characteristics would it have? Ah. Uh, I would add um, a crew, which is an off-white, which is how I feel uh, that, you know, most of the magic cards are they're sort of off-white, like a beige. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I got nothing. But. Right. As pale as most of the players, isn't it? Exactly. As pasty as the players. <laughs> well, and they're all, and, and they're all like a five, six critters. They're all fatties. So it would be fat and pasty A crew. But it would also, uh, uh, I don't know. Like, with death touch. Just not work very well. Or death yeah. stench. Um, no, it would have an all, it would have its own dynamic. Can't get a girl. They would all be males. Was, yeah. Right. That'd be, that'd be bad. Sacrifice a few enchanteds or something like that. I don't know. <laughs> um, How about you, John? If I had to <coughs> add a color, I might go... I guess they no, they actually have that color. I was going to say gold. Damn it. Oh, yeah. Good yeah, call. Yeah. I'd add green because... <laughs> because green's been missing for years. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we thought we had it. And it draw, but it turned out to be just like some sort of teal. So it was mostly blue with right. a little hint of green. Right, and that's why green cards are actually good in Innistrad. Right, because right. Because they're, they're more blue. They're more blue. Right, they're more blue. Hmm. Um, purple, maybe? I've long thought there should be purple. Uh, and kind of like Jimi Hendrix-inspired purple haze. Um, oh, so it gets all like gets creatures high? Drug-influenced drug kind of so illusions. You have here. creatures with a built-in fog? Yeah. There you go. Um, and I would go with the, uh, with Jail, a color from, uh, from another dimension that cannot be perceived by human eyes. <laughs> so... Go with Jail or go to Jail? No, no, J-A-L-E. J -E. Where are you pulling that out of? Carcosa. Where are you pulling no, that out yeah, of? No, there's someone out there who got that. Yeah, no, yeah, yeah and well. I, I'm very happy to have have uh, done this particular bit for them. Wow, the three guys who got that, they're gonna be like, "Fuck yeah, Carcosa!" I, I just wish I was one of three guys. I'm, yeah, yeah, it's not yeah, these jail. three guys. That's no. what I'm saying. Okay, I, I can accept that. Okay, uh, the I, next question comes from someone named BC. BC. Like or BC, BC before BC. Christ. I okay, it was, he's an old, an old guy. Sure, uh, but he didn't start playing until like I don't know. Some sometime AD, or like something. the dark. Yeah, <laughs> like me. Yeah. All right, so uh, but BC asked, "What is the story behind your like handles on MTGO?" Oh, so Mufuni. Yeah, uh, which is <laughs> my original one. Is just um, there's an actor Toshiro Mifune who was in Seven Samurai and uh, Sanjuro and Ojimbo and a whole bunch of uh, Kurosawa films. Pretty much every Kurosawa film. Mm -hmm. And uh, I don't know. I, he, he's I, a I, badass samurai. He John is. likes to think of himself as such. he's a Ronin. Yeah, and it was the only thing available. I tried like. Like fifty different combinations. Yeah. I hate that shit. Yeah, John with a capital J, a capital yeah, O, yeah. and it, it skunked me. And then draft diary. Um, I added that obviously because of naming after the article. Yeah, and of course there was or, his original original one, which he sold when he didn't think he was ever going to play Magic again. Right. That one actually has more of a story to it. Right. Not much of one, but yeah. more than what we've gotten so far. Uh, which was double down twenty one. Mm. Uh, which double down came from swingers. Uh, yep. which Bob introduced me to in college. And then 21 is you always double down in blackjack, so 21 came from that. Right. Uh, let's see. Okay, so my first, um, my, I guess my original uh, one's called is Archibald, 
And that was basically uh, one of my very first D&D characters ever uh, was an evil archmage. So, going <laughs> terrorizing. Imagine that, Bob, playing an evil guy. Yeah, so there was that. Um, and again, it was one of those things where I also wanted to start it with an A because I just wanted to always be at the top of the list in case people were looking for a challenge or, or to buy <laughs> from or whatever. Because when I, back when I started, um, like the, the, the community marketplace or whatever was all spam all the time. Right. And so like people like, you know, with like the beginning letters or whatever, we were up at the top or something like that. I don't know. It was messed up at the time. Um, I could be completely wrong about that too. It actually was much better, uh, but. Uh, yeah, so then I'm, but I, now I'm using Brewmaster Bob, uh, because quite frankly, I am the world's greatest deck builder. I am a Brewmaster, uh, homebrewing, uh, decks for, I'm not releasing them to the public because quite frankly, I don't think that any of you could handle it. Yeah, they're not ready. No, they're not, they're not ready. It's still in the Muppet Laboratories right now. Um, we have one that's, that's we have one that's percolating to the point of where it's, it's bursting yeah. out there. So, uh, we're about ready to release that yep. bad boy probably do some videos with it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, there will be videos, because um, we have nothing else to do. But you know Cudblade, so you know his potential. Yes, Cudblade. Cud <laughs> you know exactly his, his potential. <laughs> yeah. And the, nothing more. The monumental success that was Cudblade, or is Cudblade. Um, yeah. There you go. So, hey, it's already inspired clones, so there you go. Yeah. And George? Uh, Geomancer. And the origin? The, the origin of Geomancer? Uh, well, twofold. One, play on my name. He likes G-E-O. He likes, he likes mud pies. I shorten it. Um, also, uh, I, I kind of like the character from Valiant Comics, uh, which was Geomancer. Right. Because um, he was, for, for, for being a kind of whiny little kid, he was pretty badass. Right. Mm. And, and Valiant, uh, at least at that time, was... was just, it was freaking uh, awesome. Yeah, it was amazing. So I don't, I don't know that at all. Well... Oh man, there was a, there was a time with Valiant Comics. They were so fucking good. Yeah. yeah, and even going back and reading them, they still hold no. Up that's because really the well. stories were good. Yeah, they they weren't super topical. They were just good, solid stories. Is that the guy who's named Hopper or Hooper or what the hell his name was? The who Shooter ran? Shooter. That's what it was. Yes, yeah. Shooter Shooter, Shooter McGavin. Yes. No, Hopper Jim, Hooper. Jim Jim Hopper, Shooter Hopper Hooter Shooter <laughs> Hooper. No, Jim, Jim Shooter, the man who's been thrown out of every company he's ever worked for for being an asshole. Right. Um, but, but man, but he's really good. I really at his relate job. to that guy. The Rosewater of comics. Really? Wow. No, yeah, right. no like, Rosewater is successful. successful. Yeah, he's more yeah. like the. Jim Shooter was extremely successful for a while until people got fed up with taking his crap, and yeah, it'll happen to Rosewater too. Yeah. Eventually, people get no. fed up with it. No, when will that happen? How, how long has he been doing it? I don't know, fifteen years. Yep. And he's yeah, going to live Jim, forever. Jim yeah, Shooter was drinking the blood of the innocent for years before they finally got fed up with him at Marvel. So, okay, well, okay, well, uh, so there's potentially wonderful insight there. Yeah, and that's that's all I'm going to give you. <laughs> okay, well, that's it. <laughs> I'm out of here. <laughs>